Hi everybody, it's Nani. How you doing today? I am wonderful. I am back today with a Dollar Tree haul for you. I'm going to call this one one of my small and mighty hauls, but found some good stuff and wanted to share it with you. I wanted to tell you first, I, in one of my previous hauls, I had thanked you guys for telling me about this being a squeegee and I said I was going to try the plunger handle to see if it would work in here to make a shorter handle for me to use this in the shower. So I went ahead, got a plunger. It doesn't work. <laughs> now I can't even get this back in here. I totally mangled the threads on the inside. I'm gonna see if hubby can fix it, but it doesn't work guys. It doesn't fit, it's too big. So and then I thought, well, I could just use the plunger. You, know, you always need a nice new clean plunger. So, but now I can't get it can't get it back in there right because I screwed it up. So yeah, I'm going to try to try to figure this out or see if hubby can do it, but it's, it's just wonky. So yeah, I got a plunger, but no, the handle doesn't fit in here. So I'm going to have to try to figure something else out. The regular broom handle that you can buy separately, I just think it's going to be too long for what I need it for, but I may have to go that route anyway. But I think that's great. I think this brush will work great in my shower and I think that squeegee part will work great. So yeah, I just wanted to tell you that right off the bat. So I'm gonna go ahead like I always do and show what was in my thumbnail. They have all the Yes To products out right now and I found a bunch of the facial wipes that I wanna try. I don't think I've ever tried the Yes To facial wipes. I don't use a lot of facial wipes. I use that pink makeup removing washcloth thing that they have. So I've kind of backed off using the wipes, but name brand, I wanna try these. This one is the, it says, Yes to Tomatoes, Clear Skin Detoxifying Charcoal Facial Wipes. And it says, your favorite little black wipe with charcoal to detoxify and deep clean. These are 95% natural ingredients and you get 30 in here. So I think that's a great deal. I can smell a slight scent, but I'm not quite sure if it's from these or maybe something else, but I wanna try those. Then they have Yes To Grapefruit. These are 96% natural. And this says brightening facial wipes with vitamin C, and these are for dull and uneven skin, 30 wipes. Interesting, and then this one is Yes To Super Blueberries Skin Recharging Cleansing Facial Wipes, and it helps de-stress de overworked skin with blueberries and lemon peel to cleanse and moisturize all in one. So I think that's pretty interesting. Mm, that smells really nice. And the, the blueberry ones are 97% natural. That is a very different kind of smell. I'm kind of curious to what that will smell like on my face. But I am definitely going to, I'm definitely going to try this one because I opened it to smell it. So these other two, if one of the kids wants, they can have. Very clean product, 90, what did it say? 95%, 96%, 97% natural. Excellent. So if you guys have tried these, let me know your thoughts. You know, a nice amount of wipes in there too. So let me set these off to the side and get them out of the way. And let's go ahead and get the food stuff out of the way first. I found these and thought this was pretty cool. These are by Kellogg's. Um, it looks like the Best Buy is May of 23. These are called, called Crunch Mania Bite Size French Toast. Naturally flavored with other natural flavors and they're Graham Snacks. There's four, four little bags in here of 1.76 ounces each. So let's go ahead and open these up. Wow, nice size bag. You wouldn't think 1.75 would be very much, but these have some weight to it. And the serving size is the whole pouch, and it's 210 calories in the entire entire pouch. This feels like a lot. 
So let's go ahead and try this. I know you guys like it when I do try things. I have to smell. It smells like graham crackers. Little squares. What did they... Does it say anything about cinnamon? I definitely smell cinnamon, which if it's French toast, I'm sure there's cinnamon. It looks like little slices of bread. Super hard. Mmm. Those are good. These would be good little dippers for coffee. These are really good, guys. I like that. Crunch Mania. I, I've never even seen these like in Walmart or anything. Mmm. That's good. I may have to pick up another one of these if I see them in the store. Maybe put those in Easter baskets. That is, that's really good. Really good. If you see those, try those. If you like like a harder cookie with a cinnamon, mm, yum. And then guys, I went kind of overboard on the jelly beans. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to keep some of these here, but they're mostly going to be for in each one of the grandkids Easter baskets, maybe even the grown up kids. I don't even know if I got them all that I know I don't have the, um, like the Dollar Tree version jelly beans. I can't think of what the name of those were. I didn't pick those, those up, but a bunch of name brands I did. These are the Chewy and Tangy Sweet Tart Jelly, be jelly Beans. And it's a five ounce pack. And it says the flavors. No, it doesn't. It does not say the flavors. I thought maybe that was flavors, but it's not. But these are the Sweet Tart. And then I picked up a thing of the Fruit Loop. I don't know if you can see in here. There's like a, a weird shaped one in there. I can't see it, but it looks like it's three jelly beans melted together. But Fruit Loop flavor, and I believe I already have one of these. Then I got one of the Jelly Belly assorted. And these are the um, normal flavors, not the crazy sickening flavors. It has like blueberry, bubblegum, popcorn, peach, licorice, cinnamon, cherry, just the normal, not like puke and that type of stuff. I didn't see any of those, or I probably would have picked some up. Then they have the now and later jelly beans, and the flavors in here are apple, cherry, strawberry, watermelon, grape, and banana. Oh, this one might stay here. I'd like to try the banana one. And I'm sorry, I'm not telling you the ounces. This is a four ounce, the now and later. The jelly bellies is a little small one. It's a 2.6. The fruit loops is a 3.5. The Sweet Tart, I think I said that one, is a five ounce. And then the last one that I found is Jello. Jello Jelly Beans. And it is a four ounce. And the flavors in here are lime, cherry, berry blue, strawberry, and orange. So each one of the grandkids is going to get a different, a different type of jelly bean and then they can just share them. Everybody can try a different different type. Nice. And I don't even know if this is all of them. If you guys know, let me know because I have no idea. And then let's see. Let me move some stuff over here and get the stuff I showed you out of the way. Hubby needed a thing of deodorant and he is actually able to go back to the gym. He can do just about anything now except put his leg out to the side. But he's allowed to start working out on the elliptical again gently. He's allowed to walk no matter how far he wants. All of that he is able to do. He's still using a cane, but working himself off of that. He still does have some pain, but the surgeon said with all the repair work they had to do in there that this is going to be a slower process. And we're definitely seeing that, but he's just, he's doing great. And, you know, we thank you guys again for thinking of us and thinking of him and the prayers and positive thoughts and all of it, but he's doing really well. So this is for in his gym bag. And this is the Dove Men's Care Clean Comfort 24 Hour Aluminum Free Deodorant. And it's a 1.75 little rollerball. He likes these little tiny ones just to throw in his gym bag. They don't take up a lot of space and and this smells good. I just stuck that right up my nose. I'm glad there was no deodorant on it. So that's what that is for. 
And then I saw this right at checkout. They had these little card games. And this says, be the first to unscramble the sweet treat. And it's called Mishmash Card Game. And it says the sweet treat edition. So there must be other editions. This is 36 cards in here. Collect all four. And then it shows you on the back. You have to, the, the letters are all scrambled up. And you have to kind of figure out what the dessert is. Like this one up here. And then it's, what is it? Hot Fudge Sunday. So I thought this would be fun for um, when we go up to Allison and Brian's for Thanks Hunt Miss. Just in the evenings, we, we play games almost every evening we're there. And I thought this would be fun for us to just to get a little chuckle out of. So that's going to go in the Thanks Hunt Miss bag. Cool. And then, oh, here's one more food item. They had these. thought we'd give these a try. We love trying the different drinks. This is called Ready Sports Drink. Real food, carb source, zero grams of added sugar, electrolytes for hydration. This is the fruit punch, and it's a 16.9 fluid ounce. And I believe they had another flavor as well, but I just grabbed one of these to try. And it is colored in there, if you can see that. But I thought this looked interesting. We like having these type of um, just different hydrating drinks around, just to give them a try. It says we don't add sugar. We use super fruits, real, real food carbs. I'm stuttering today, guys. B vitamins and three dominant electrolytes for complete hydration. No added sugar, blah, blah, blah. I just said all that. Super fruits and B vitamins. So if you guys have tried this, let me know. I can't remember what the other flavor was. Maybe cherry? I can't remember, but I, we just picked up one just to try it. And I don't know if there there is a Best Buy, but... Let me see if I can read it. June of 24 is the best buy on that. I don't think I've ever seen this brand before, this Ready. So that'll go in the fridge for us to give it a try. And then they had all of the little, they're like, these are like the golden book dupes, little bend in books are what these are. And they had the, the traditional stories. They had the three little pegs, and I just like their illustrations. And these are actually the story. It, you know, there's a lot more reading to do in these books. But the illustrations are so cute in them. So we got the three little pigs. The ugly duckling. He just looks so sad. Oh, he looks happy there. But he looks sad on the cover. And then Goldilocks and the Three Bears. And this one got a little crinkled in the bag. I kind of threw the bag down wrong and I did that. It wasn't that way at the store. But Goldilocks and the Three Bears. If you guys junk journal or whatever, you know, their illustrations in here are super nice. So these are going to be for the littlest grand lady. Just to have here at the house. She loves books. So whenever she comes, either me or Poppy, we read to her. She reads to us. And I thought these would be these would be really cute for her. Quite a while back, we had picked her up some of the books that were um the pop out. When you open the book, the pictures kind of popped out. Those got destroyed. She was way too little for those. That she thought that it was fun just to rip them apart. But that's her job, right? So we'll stick to just these for a little bit longer, the regular reading books. But these were the only three we saw. I don't know if there are others. Does it say on the back? Sometimes they actually say what the um, what's in the series, but I don't see it in this one. So if you guys know if there's a fourth, usually Dollar Tree works in fours. Let me know. So yeah, these are just for here. All right, everybody, that is it for this haul. I'm going to go ahead and get this stuff put away and move along with my day. I hope you're all doing well. If you like this type of thing, please subscribe. I'd love to have you as part of my YouTube family. You guys are the best. Have a great day, everyone. And I'll talk to you again here really soon. Peace.